In this module, we're going to be talking about preparing the assessment. Preparing the assessment is the very first step in the NISC security control assessment process. In this step, we have to determine what types of assessments will be done and what will be needed and as, as well as who needs to do the actual assessment. One of the first steps of this is the organization selecting the appropriate assessor or assessment team to conduct the assessment for the security controls. They have to know their environment and they have to know their requirements. Part of understanding their requirements is ensuring that the appropriate policies are covered, ensuring the appropriate policies are covering the security and privacy control assessments, making sure that those are in place and understood by all who's affected in the organization. For example, if there's an organizational policy that says, network scans will be done annually by an independent assessor but it can't affect mission systems then everybody has to understand this before they get started the organization should also be familiar with what step that system is in before they actually conduct the assessment on that particular system in other words if they're in the categorized phase of their system development in other words if they happen to be in the implementation of system controls they maybe they just implemented those controls and this is a new system they need to know what part of this risk management framework process they're in if they're already in the ongoing phase where they're monitoring all the controls and they're just going through the annual control assessment that they do then they need to know what part of the NIST risk management framework framework process that they're in so that they can have a better understanding of what is to be expected when the assessment happens. The organization needs to also understand the objectives and the scope of the assessment. For example, the purpose of the assessment and what is actually being assessed. The organization must know the scope of the assessment, meaning what all the assets that we're actually going to touch. Uh, are we just scanning external IPs? Are we going to scan internal and external IPs? Are we hitting just the documentation of the organization internally what are we actually going to do and what is the scope of this perhaps the purpose of the assessment is an annual assessment that's coming from the Department of Homeland Security or some other organization that's outside the organization whatever it is the organization needs to know the purpose and the scope of the assessment and that's one of the very first steps